Hey guys, welcome to this video. Today I'm going to be going over a small add-on I've made for the Blender game engine which you guys might find useful. Basically what it is, is it's called FPS Setup and what it does is adds an FPS setup to your game. So if we go over here and add ourselves a floor, give ourselves some GOSL shading, uh, then what we can basically do with Blender game selected is you can just put the cursor anywhere, so maybe up here, click Add FPS Setup, uh, it will automatically tell you up here it's been added. It will also set the active camera to this one here. And so now if you go into texture view, you have full controls including sprint and also jumping, which is nice and smooth instead of being juttery. You can add multiple copies as well and each of them are sort of separate from each other. Also once you do add an FPS setup, you'll notice the main body here is selected so you can pretty much, as soon as you click that, you can move this wherever you want it if the cursor was in the wrong location. So if you'd like to get this add-on, there's a link down in the description below if you want to download it. Now to install this, all you have to do is go to File, User Preferences, and then under Add-ons here, just go to Install from File. Then navigate to your Downloads folder or wherever you have it. It will be a zip file like this. Then just go Install from File, then click that, and now it should be added. It will also tell you here that it's been added to it. So here we have a small setup, some information on it. Uh, basically just select it here and you'll notice we get the option then just click save user settings so it's there whenever you open up blender and so now just to prove that it works otherwise you can just click file new and then open up the menu here and add an fps setup it's fairly simple but can be fairly useful especially for saving time hopefully you guys find it useful if you do feel free to leave a like comment or share down below if you have any other improvements or suggestions feel free to leave them down below as well but apart from that hope you enjoyed the add-on have an awesome week and i'll see you guys in the next one